Hi guys, how's it going? Uh, this is the Scan Tool Network, and I just really wanted to make a quick video of the iCarsoft POR version 3.0. Um, it's a little bit diagnostic world, just click the link in the description below this video, it'll take you to the genuine product. Um, but the purpose of the video is really because I wanted to show you some actuation tests or component testing or bi directional, whatever you want to call it, uh, and also some live data that you can expect to get from the tool itself. So, what I'll do first of all is I'm just going to go into I've got this tool plugged into the diagnostic port of the vehicle, it's a Porsche Macan and we're going to go to, well, we'll select the vehicle first of all so we'll go to control unit and this allows you to select whatever um, system you want so I'll do, I'll show you a little bit of component testing first of all and then we'll show you some live data so uh, there's two really easy ways of showing you this I'm going to show you first of all the I'll show you front end electronics so this is the case for any system that you go into any system you go into you'll get a menu system like this which has read faults clear faults view the live data and then the actuation test so actuation test basically tests the motor um, or the system of whatever system you're in um, so for example if we go to actuators we can go to let's see now windshield wiper actuation so just click on that that's obviously in German so just click past that though click OK and then we we'll go uh, is it? click on to that click on enter level 1 so you can choose whichever uh, level you want so for example we go level 1 and we go F1 to start and there you see the wipers are going okay we can go back into that and we can go level 2 so that shows you them a bit quicker to stop you can just click on F2 or you can just come out of it All right, so that's uh, sort of one example of that I'll show you a different system as well if we go into the passengers door again you've got the fault codes the view data and the actuation test so we'll go to uh, lower side window so we'll we'll just lower the window I can't uh, sort of maneuver the camera around so listen out for the window going down if I go F1 and then I go F1 to continue there you, are, you probably heard that just stop that go back and then we'll go to raise window the same again and there you heard the window go back up so that is in a nutshell the uh, the PO version 2.0 showing you I'm sorry about the glare on the screen showing you how to do activation tests or actuation tests should I say um, if you wanted to maybe get some say live data from the vehicle um, the engine system is a good option for this a good one to show because we can go well you can go into actuation test and it'll do all sorts of actuation tests for the uh, the engine system but what I wanted to show you was the um, oh no when live data sorry sorry live data view data so you can go you can choose which which of the engine system you want to look at so for example you can go to the diesel the diesel particulate filter which is the DPF and this shows you di di 15 different options depending on which vehicle you're in so as an example here we are in the, uh, the transmission so we're getting all of the different temperatures here that we'll need so let's say for example you wanted to change the transmission temperature but you needed to know that the the fluid was at a certain temperature before you do it well this will give you the information ahead of the change so it shows lots of different variants lots of different sections as well so that's the temperatures if we go to say for example the uh, where is it? Um, sorry. View data. The catalytic converter. Diesel particulate filter. So we'll just select all of these. And F1. And then we're getting a lot of DPF data from the vehicle here. So particle filter measured suit rate. Ahead of particle filters, the exhaust gas temperatures. A lot of different temperatures time since regeneration so you see there's lots of different values in here which would be useful for you 
if you need to maybe carry out a DPF regeneration, which you can do with this tool. Um, okay, so that is that. So that's really just a, a quick demonstration of live data and actuation or component testing using the POR version 3.0. I'm sorry about the glare on the screen here. It's uh, sun shining right through. I normally try to avoid that, but I can't in this particular case. But it's available, as I say, at Diagnostic World. It's www.diagnostic-world.com. I'll put a link to this kit in the description below this video. Thanks for watching, and I hope it helps.